From fresh paint to new plants and updated posters, Playland is being prepped for its 92nd season. Recently, the Art Deco Gem, the only government-owned amusement park in the U.S., has gotten some bad press. That casts doubt on whether this park is ready to be opened safely and properly. This park is ready to be opened safely and properly. To prove it, the county executive and his team offered a media tour. Is the food handled in a safe manner? The health commissioner says yes. The restaurants are inspected and issues are addressed. Kept at a distance, representatives of Standard Amusements. That's the private company that just lost the contract to run the park. They claim the county is whitewashing concerns raised by their experts and consultants. Because of the age of the park, you're saying some of the facilities are not appropriate for modern hygienic standards. That's correct, Tony. It's going to take a lot of redoing a lot of these buildings, new surfaces, new floors, new ceilings, new walls, everything, correct plumbing, hand washing facilities. Standard and the county put out dueling reports complete with photos. County Executive Latimer says given Playland's age, you will see things that look war worn and dated by age, but you will see cleanliness, you will see health, and you will also see that things are operating in the proper fashion. The county says the state will sign off on every ride and the health department on every food facility before the park opens at noon on Saturday. In Rye, Westchester County, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News.